we both had the same composition teacher, Shandor Veresh, and this gives nearly a sense of family. But I met him, I think it was in 73 or so, the first time. But I was leading the SIMC group in, in Basel for modern music. And there we programmed Kurt Tag already in the 60s. And uh, from the first note I heard from him, I was completely fascinated. And, and I think till today he, he is very unique in the world of composers, that every note he writes is uh, essential. There is never an idea of small talk. There is never an idea of of wanting to please somebody or audience. For him it's only the truth is, is the essential that you never should, can lie when you make music. The sense of a, of a phrase in music that every musical period or sentence is really one phrase, one bow, and has tension, detention, and not single abstract notes or abstract intervals. In German one talks of Klangrede, and this, this is very much what I, I feel and what Shandor Veresh felt and what Kurtak feels uh, in music. And, and this is probably the most striking similarity. I'm unable to, to write music without having the sense of, of a, a melodic sense of the notes. For me, melody is absolutely not old-fashioned. It's, uh, it's a thing that was lost, but for me it's essential. For him, music is very often writing, for when somebody dies, a memoriam. And because music is the only art who can go beyond the threshold of life and death. It's like Orpheus who went to the other underworld as musician, and the, not the painter went to. There, yeah, because when the words stop, the sound starts. Probably, it's a sort of meta language who comes after the words are at their end, and and this is Yuri's way to write those memorial pieces. But it's also my way. For most f dead friends, I write uh, a piece. Sometimes I'm not even writing memoriam, but just the name or, or so on. <laughs> 